So for the purposes of this demo, I'm going to show you how to download the Anki for your iPhone and how to sync your iPhone to your desktop Anki. And that would be it for today's video. So I'm going to show you exactly how to do this. It's very simple. You want to go to your app store and you want to type in Anki. And it's going to be the second one here called Anki Mobile Flashcards. So this is the one you want. And unfortunately, you have to pay for it. Uh, my recommendation is that you do. I recommend that to all of my students because we'll be using Anki a lot in the program. So once you've bought it, just click on open. From here, just let's leave it. We'll leave it. It's good that we've downloaded. We're going to go create our Anki ID. In order to sync your mobile Anki app to your desktop Anki app or to all other different platforms that you might use, we need to create an Anki ID. So in order to do that, let me take you through the next steps. So what I want to do is go to ankiweb.net. From here, you want to click on sign up. Sign up with an email address that you will use. And for me, I'll just go don.lee.com. And then same again, create a password and just go scroll to the bottom. I've read the terms and conditions. Continue. So it's going to send you a confirmation email to the email that you've signed up with. Just go to your inbox and click on confirm and you've, you would have signed up your account. So that's it. So once you've done that, you want to go back. So when I signed in, I'm going to have a lot of content, but for you, you you won't see anything. You're, you're probably going to just see, um, default. This is all you will see. So this is my account. So that's why I have a lot of content. Yours will have nothing on it for now. So here we go. So all of the content is online. It's on a browser. It's through my ID. Do the same thing on your mobile app and also on your desktop app. So here's what we do. Now you want to go back to your mobile application. So let's open up your mobile application for Anki. And from here, you want to sign in with the ID that you've created. So if you remember, we just created an ID for your Anki. So what you want to do is click on synchronize and log in with the same email and password that you just signed up with for Anki. So I'm going to go with Dawn. Okay. So when I click on OK, it's going to ask um, the DEX that I have in this application is different from the DEX that I have online. Because right now in this app, there's nothing here, right? That's why it's different. So what I want to do is bring all the DEX I have in the Anki web, which is on the browser, to this mobile application. So I click on Download from Anki web. Okay, so that's all I want to click on. Download from Anki Web. So essentially what I'm doing is I'm dragging all of the content that's online to this mobile app. And once it's finished loading, it should look like this. All the Anki text that was online, I've dragged it to my mobile application. Now we want to bring the decks into our desktop Anki using the same ID so that everything is synced up together. So it's very simple. Um, you want to go to sync, log in with the same ID and password that you just did with your mobile app. So for me, and then I'm going to click on OK. So same thing, 
it's asking you if you want to download from the Anki web. And yes, you want to click download from Anki web because right now in our desktop Anki, nothing is in here. We want to download all the decks that we have online to our desktop app. Now, in your case, yours will have nothing. So it doesn't really matter, but always do download from Anki web like this. After it finished downloading, you'll see all of my decks in my desktop Inky. So I want to be clear, yours will not show anything here. It's all it's, just, it's going to be just the default because you're just starting. But with my account, I've already have daily biz plus, daily slang, daily abbreviations, and all the other things that I've been using for my own use. And so if you don't be confused, right? I want to just be very clear. Yours will only show default for now. Later on, you're going to have your own folders, or we call these the master decks. And I'm going to show you how to build that in the next training. So don't worry about these for now. Now, what I want to do to end this training is show you how to download the flashcard from the Daily Biz Plus newsletter into your application. And to do that, you can do two things. Either you can go from your desktop or you can do it from your mobile phone, your mobile app. And in this purpose, I'm gonna show you with the desktop app. So while you're sitting in front of your computer, just bring out your browser. Now, all you need to do is click on add to your collection. Click on download. And you'll see the download that happened at the bottom here. So all you need to do is just click on it. Click close. And it should automatically show in your desktop app right here. So I'm going to do that for the other ones. This is for the slang. Download. Close. There it is. And I also want to do my abbreviation. Download. So what I usually do from here is I put it into the right folders. So the die is cast is for daily biz plus. I drag it underneath there. What's gotten into you is daily slang. I'll drag it in there. BLT is abbreviation. I'll drag it in there. So if I click on plus, you'll see all of the daily biz plus flashcards that I've organized. Same goes for daily slang and daily abbreviations. Now I want to show you how to do it from your phone. And from here, I'm going to click on add to your collection. Click on download. You're going to see that it appears to download at the bottom here. So I'm going to click on download. And I'm going to open in. You can see copy to Anki. That's what I want to click. Import complete. So there you go. The die is cast, you can see it. That's today's Daily Biz Plus. I've got it right in my mobile Anki app. So I wanna do the same thing for all the others. I wanna click on add to your collection for slang. So we've got all of today's Daily Biz Plus flashcards into our mobile application. Now, the neat thing about this is I showed you separately. I showed you how to do it on your desktop and I just showed you now how to do it on your mobile app. You only need to do it on the one because it's all synced, remember? So if you just do it with your phone, if you're a phone guy, if you like to use on your, your Anki on your phone, then all you need to do is from your phone, click on synchronize at the bottom. Now, when you click on synchronize, it's updating all the new flashcards into your ID. So it's also going to show up on your desktop. It's also going to show up on your Inky web, which is online, your browser. So you just gotta do it once and it's gonna show up. 
on all of your different platforms, whether it's desktop, browser, mobile app. That's the beauty of what we just did today. All you need to do is click on sync because you just have one ID for your Anki. I hope you found this training helpful and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.